All right, folks, this is it. This is the uh, men's final shaping up. Right here is our men's fleet getting on the water. Right now, we've got Julian Kernair, looks like out there in front, we've got in this heat, Smith, Gruber, Norman, Lake, Mouse, Tonek, Kernair, Teradin, and Ben Ali. It's shaping up to be a battle. These guys have been uh, the top three in their qualifying heats, and it is on right now as they're making that run towards that first mark. It looks like that's Brian Lake gonna be making that hold shot. Let's see if he can turn that kite a little bit faster and slow down. Looks like he's holding on to that first place spot around the mark. Coming in, it looks like uh, on that RD kite. I think that is Tomek. And it could be Gruber on that green north kite following him in third. But look at this lead that uh, Brian Lake is putting together. That's Julian Kernair in fourth, fifth, Ozzie Smith. Lake just taking the charge after that first buoy rounding putting a massive lead in front of him and the rest of the pack. Looks like we're gonna have a battle for second and third. Florian Gruber from Germany, hunting down this competitor right in front of there. I think that could be Mouse right there. Actually, it could be Mouse on that north, not Gruber. And these guys are really uh, giving it their all as Brian Lake is just Way out in the lead. Let's see. Oh, Kernera catches a wingtip and goes down on that buoy. Going down. We've got a bit of a cluster here as these guys are uh, just struggling. Looks like Oswald Smith also in that mix up. But Brian Lake way out in front. Followed by uh, that orange kite right there, which uh, I believe is either Teradine or Norman. And in third, I believe that is Florian Gruber. Fifth, Potomac, or fourth rather, as Brian Lake has got an open, open door for that finish line. I don't think there's much that can go wrong for him now unless he uh, so just explodes, but I don't think that's gonna be case. And that Ocean Rodeo kite coming in, finishing in second place. Not sure who that guy is, but he's finishing second and third. Who is it gonna be? It is the guy on the green north kite. So that's gonna be our top three. Fourth, it looks like coming in fourth on that RD kite is gonna be Tomek. As those guys, uh, the rest of the fleet in the back of the pack really got hung up on uh, I believe that second mark going down pretty big and uh, Brian Lake making his way back to the beach. We'll wait for those official results as the slalom action continues here from beautiful St. Peter Ording, Germany. A bit of a cloud cover in the sky and winds are quite light but uh, we've got slalom racers using their biggest kites and uh, biggest boards as they are uh, putting the pedal to the metal here on this slalom course. Onshore winds, we're looking at about 12 to 14 knots on the course, so guys definitely using their biggest biggest gear, but uh, interesting final there from those men here. We're waiting for our women to set up. They're gonna go into sequence here in a second, and we'll be back with that, so there's more to come live from St. Peter Ording, Germany.